go to textures.com and find some metal. Download the Avito normal. Open a new general file. Select everything and delete it. Add in a circle and we're going to rotate it 90 degrees on the X axis. Go to the front view. Tab into edit mode. We're going to extrude and scale that extrude down a little bit to give it some thickness that way. <laughs> And then we can tab out of that view. We can go ahead and go to the modifier tab, add a modifier, and it'll be the solidify. We are going to give it a thickness of 0.4 meters thick. We got to apply that. Can't apply it in edit mode, so we apply now, and we unwrap it in a sphere project. Shading. Let's go ahead and go new gold. Then we're going to go ahead and add in an image texture. We're just going to duplicate that. Then add in a normal map. Plug the normal into the normal of the principal shader, and then the color into the strength of the normal map. And then you can go ahead and open your normal for this one, and then set it to non-color. Then we can go ahead and go color to color on this top one, open our albedo. Then we'll give it lots of metallic, because we want lots of metallic. And then roughness, we'll go ahead and take it down all the way. And would you look at that? But you can still see all the faces. It's not smooth. So let's go to back to the layout tab. Go to the material preview so we can preview it. W shade smooth. But we can do some more modifications. We'll go to the modifier tab, subdivision surface. Just so then in rendered view it'll look nice. You can go world. And for the color, we'll make it an environment color. Open our environment. HDRI, I just got this room off of HDRI Haven, you can get it, link will be in the description possibly. Let's just add in a plane, add in a, maybe a random material. There, that should be good. And I will catch you later.